Our next artiste, it's the tattooed Scotsman, Danny Boy. Thank you. It's lovely to be here, folks, back in Melbourne. I've got quite cultural this year. I went on a wine tour yesterday. <laughs> yeah, never been on a wine tour before, you know, been on pub crawls. <laughs> it's not quite the same thing, is it? You get your cock out in a wine tour, nobody laughs. <laughs> I mean nobody, the whole bus froze, it was embarrassing. I said, I'm terribly sorry, I've misread this situation. It won't happen again. I'm not wild about the pretentiousness that goes with wine. You know, people seem to be obsessed nowadays by the age of a wine and the region it comes from. Oh, do come round. I've just picked up a cheeky little five-year-old from the... Well, no. <laughs> That's wrong. You look at the same with beer drinkers. You don't go around to a friend's house and he goes, Oh, Danny, I'm glad you're here, mate. I've had a four-day-old VB sitting out in the <laughs> porch there. Oh, well, what a wonderful bouquet of stale piss. <laughs> with just a hint of domestic violence. How... <laughs> Do you think when Jesus... When he turned his water into wine at that very famous miracle, do you think there was picky wine drinkers there? Just going, oh, no, Jesus, no. <laughs> no, 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 it's white wine with fish. <laughs> anyway, so I went on this wine tour, and there was this couple from Surrey in England, the poshest couple you've ever seen in your life. He had a tweed suit on, you know, it looked like a couch. <laughs> with a shooting stick. What the shooting stick was for, I don't know. Just to prod me every so often. You monkey boy, what are you doing with my wine tour? Huh? Are you poor? You look poor. <laughs> so I watch with interest, right? The three of us line up. Him, his wife, me. He picks up his glass first of all. Oh, yes, I smell. Oh, apricot. And, and lime. And lemon. And strawberry. <laughs> and raspberry. <laughs> and vanilla. I'm thinking, has this guy got a smoothie? <laughs> I've just got wine. This seems unfair. We all neck that. Then his, his wife, it's her turn. She's got the Chardonnay, slightly drier. Ooh, she says, very dry, very oaky, and smoky, and barky. <laughs> yes, barky, <laughs> monkey boy. Have you ever licked the bark of a tree? No. Well, that is how it tastes. Barky. <laughs> and we all neck that, right? Then it's my turn. I had no idea what to do. I said, look, maybe you better just skip me out. Don't be ridiculous, monkey boy. <laughs> I said, I don't know what to do. He said, let your senses guide you. Let your senses guide you. Say the first thing that comes into your head. I said, all right, then. Picked up this glass. I went, hmm, crushed grapes. <laughs> Folks, you've been absolutely great. Enjoy the rest of your night. My name's been Danny Boy. Good night.